August 26, 2008. With more Web 2.0 news you can use, I'm Brad Fallon. First up, Microsoft has officially entered the world of Facebook applications. Redmond recently announced the launch of Collabio, a Facebook game designed to study keyword creation. In Collabio, Facebook users pick which words best describe their friends. Points are tallied by the amount of times a keyword matches a word listed by another friend. The ultimate goal, analysts say, is to fully understand why an individual picks one keyword over another. Collabio is available now on Facebook. In other news, Magnolia, a social bookmarking site similar to Delicious, has recently announced plans to upgrade its site. Magnolia 2.0, or M2 as it's currently known, will be built upon entirely new code and be completely open source. Users will be able to download and run their own version of M2 and link it to the main magnolia.com site. Support for other technologies, such as the OpenID system, is currently being considered. M2 is expected to launch in September. In search engine news, TechCrunch has a fascinating article about the popularity of Yahoo in Japan. Yahoo is the reigning king of the Japanese search scene, a sharp contrast to their status of distant second to Google everywhere else in the world. According to writer Sir Kantoto, Yahoo's success in Japan is due in large part to its willingness to adapt its business practices to better fit into the Japanese marketplace. Aside from the traditional search and mail services, Yahoo Japan runs their own broadband ISP, has deals in place with the likes of Sharp and MySpace, and even holds the naming rights for a baseball stadium. And finally, here's a great article on Google AdWords. In the second reason to use AdWords, writer Mark Widower states that the tracking tools that lie within AdWords can tell you a boatload about which keywords are the most important to your site. Once you've collected the proper keywords, you can then employ them in other facets of your website. For a link to this article and everything else in today's report, visit FreelineReport.com. Until next time, I'm Brad Fallon. For Web 2.0 news you can use in 2.0 minutes, visit FreelineReport.com.